Hello everyone, and welcome back to a Cry and Shames Factorio Mega Base series thing. Alright, so we are chopping down some of these guys here. Do a little bit of landfill in this area. Get that going. Nope, okay cool, right there. What am I doing? A grenade! Good grenades. Grenades are awesome. Cutting down trees manually. Look how flea them up. They think I am. I've been doing that in a while. Old time stuff going on there. Alright, so that down. Grab some of these guys. I need something like right here. Right here. There. And we need right here as well. So there, that, that, nope. Let's we'll put some lights down for effect. Because we like cool effects like lights and whatnot. Anything here. Put light down and put pull down. Alright. So that is a whole nother line of iron coming up. So hopefully that'll help as well. I'm thinking it's just more iron ore coming in. We're going to need to get some stuff going. By stuff I mean we need more iron. More, more iron. So I might have to come over here. Oh, that's the scanning. I think I'm here. It's two million sitting there. Some over here and here and here and how are those how are those walls coming up? Because we need we need to get those walls going. Another thing we need to do is get enough power so that we can turn around and use laser turrets. Because that would be good. We need batteries for that as well. Uh, we have laser turrets, but we just need to automate batteries. Okay. Iron plate, copper plate, and sulfuric acid. Sulfuric acid is sulfur, iron plates, and water. Sulfur requires water and petroleum gas. Okay. So I think that might be the next thing we need to do, because without creating choke points for the biters, we're going to have a, a lot of issues with dealing with them, and we're not going to be able to supply the turrets we have with ammo on those far away places. We're going to need to rely on laser turrets instead. Um, so this is dwindling. I mean, it's slowly producing, right? What are you doing here? So much fire! <laughs> oh, I'm looking forward to fire. We are not keeping up with that production, are we? We are now at a point. Um, we are. That's about maxed out now. So I mean, it's keeping up. Actually, it's the these guys are not keeping up because there's not a high enough iron supply coming in. I'm afraid of that. I will admit that fact. Afraid there wouldn't be enough iron coming in from that spot. To supply that. And uh, happens to be the correct thing. Not enough pipes here either to keep up. Oh, there's pipes. There's time, I guess. Alright, so I mean, that's good for the most part. Hardly optimal in any way, shape, or form. How is this going? What are we, what are we doing here? Why has this stopped? Let's check why this has stopped, shall we? Why have you stopped? You have a lot of heavy oil? Why do you have all that heavy oil? Why is it you used everything else but you have all that extra heavy oil? They should be using them equally. Right? Because they're produced equally. I'm like going crazy, right? The basic split. Yeah, it's 30 and 30. 
And the oil, this guy here, is 1550. It should be even. That I messed me up early on? I'm not sure what that's all about. I'll keep an eye on this. I'm only being texted right now, I apologize for the interruptions. But, yeah, alright, so. They, don't, they seem to be keeping the same. I guess they were just holding a bunch of extra in the same way that this was holding. Hopefully this will work perfectly fine now. I don't know, I don't have an, I don't have an explanation for that. To be honest. Oh, someone's being hit. Oh, nothing special there. Look at that. That iron. Look at all that iron. Steel's so backed up right now. You probably take some iron from up here. And bring it down to down here. Oh, look at that. It's actually maxed out on there. Well. What do you know? Ain't that something. May want to rework that a little bit. Get that working faster, but not right now. I want sulfuric acid. Like with the supply though of petroleum gas, which kind of sucks by a lot. I need more refineries. I need. Requires piping, requires all this other stuff. It's a lot of. Uh, it's a lot of headache. That's what it is. These are all full with oil. So, yeah, the, the bottleneck here is these refineries. And hopefully, you know, these are still increasing. I see what the problem is. We're not making these fast enough. So, they're going to both backlog eventually. So we're not making those fast enough, which kind of stinks. Can we produce more steel down here? Or bring a line down, either way. Uh, this is, this is the process that we really want to have. But we need production science and high-tech science for that. It's crazy. That's, that's gonna do processing. This enrichment process is what we really want, honestly. But we're not gonna be able to do that at the moment. Logistic system is so expensive too. Oh my. My heart. My heart. Alright, power armor. It's a power armor. Things are so expensive. I know later on it's gonna like be no problem at all, but right now it's just like that is out of reach. That is not happening. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do this. We're gonna take off this spot here. Bring in more iron coming down this way. Not a whole lot, mind you. From that, actually. Yeah, that's not a whole lot. Matter of fact, it's not really doing much help by itself. So I'm trying to get this line down. You need to move out of the way. You are in the way, my big sir. I'll just do that here. There. Once again, squid base stuff going on here. Giddy base. Well, that's going to be a good amount of extra iron coming in. So more iron means more steel and maybe it'll help keep up with the amount we need. This is probably going to eventually back up anyway no matter how hard we try because we don't have a direct line of materials coming down. Nevertheless, we are need to... We are need... We need to... Put this down here. We need a lot of piping. So let's get a few undergrounds. Let's clear this a little up down here so we can actually see these pieces that are grating. And then a bunch of piping. Alright, so you are third. 
there, there, good. I know I have piping back at base, but I'm not gonna walk all the way back at base just for pipes. If I can handcraft them, just fine. Alright, and then the third one's gonna be petroleum. We need one more underground. And the pipe screen should be fine. That's, that's one, that's the one, not the three. Fantastic. Alright. There, and there, and then we're going to need a lot of piping. Uh, let's do that, that, and we need 200 gram sets. There we go. And advanced oil processing. What is that required? Like, how, what do I need to get there? And what is this exactly? Water to crude. And yeah, it produces 55. And I think that's closer to what I remember back then in the good old processing days. We have Science Pack 3. So this is going to be next. We'll do power armor and then we'll do the advanced oil. Mm, my voice just cracked there. All right. Then we'll do advanced oil, link, oil processing afterwards because we need better oil processing. This is not working out. We're actually having a bit of backlog now. Awesome. Which means we can actually get some sulfuric acid. So we're going to need to do something like that here. We need underground and some piping. New water. I guessed the placement of that, by the way. I did not know that was the correct spot. I need um, this offshore pump. I, whatever, no. Uh, that one here. But, come on. Thank you. And uh, some other grounds. And some fish. Do 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 Okay. What a great it's. Right here. It's right there where I'm standing. Oh, oh, oh. Awesome. A few more pipes. And water it is. Cool. So, this will create sulfur. A lot of it for fairly cheap amounts, and we're going to need sulfuric acid, which is going to be created with iron and water and whatnot. And we might want to do sulfuric acid up there somewhere. So, what we can do... So that's done. So we need advanced oil, please. Thank you. We're going to create a, another line, like we did before. Oh, this will be fine. There, there. Place that down. Underground. And let's make a line of this stuff as well. And bring it back. So we can use it to do stuff. Back at base. And it'll probably be easier if I had trains and whatnot set up. We should start working on trains in the near future anyway, because I'm going to need them to get better iron sources. Okay, 
right, that'll do for now. Now what I can do is need iron, right? Where's my granadas? Granada. And this spot right here. That's nothing there. Actually, that works. That works hilariously perfectly. Um, so yeah, this is just going to be storage. We'll have storage down. We'll move down storage. So we don't have a proper process for these guys yet. But we'll just do this. Uh, coal liquefaction. Oh, so we have the heavy tube, light, and light. Yep. Coal liquefaction. Steam, coal, and heavy oil to create. Okay. Interesting. And you can loop the, the heavy oil back on itself as well. That is interesting. We don't, so, yeah, we don't have production science, I don't think. We have science pack 3s, right? Yeah, science pack 3s, not production. We only have the ability to make production science. I don't even know what that requires. What does that require? Uh, oh. Well, it answers that question real quick. Let's get those anyway. Okay, so that was interesting to learn a little bit. And we're going to need some wooden chests. Actually, no, let's not do wooden chests. Let's do steel chests because we're going to need one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three. That's fine. We're going to need to store as much of this as possible. That. And I'm going to need to take one of these guys. And I am out of cover and steel. Crud. Can I, can I reach over to there? Can I do that? If so, that's what I'm doing. Yes, I can. There. So I just need sulfur acid. Should be able to do something like this crazy contraption I'm putting together here. Do not sulfur, sulfuric acid. We need iron on the line somewhere. Put a thing here. No, it's not enough space. Sulfur, iron, water. There's water right there. Silver right there. So I just need iron to come down here somehow. And this crazy split of stuff. I'm gonna do something that I would never recommend anyone else to do unless you're really just being lazy about stuff. This is what I'm doing. I wouldn't even recommend doing this for lazy reasons because you're better off not going the lazy route. 99.999% of the time. Actually, I'm going to need to go over here.
And I didn't grab anything from up top, so... Grab some... stuff. Need some steel... here. Okay, we'll get to the point where we have robots, like a... Actual suit and robots going on. Processing units. Yeah, we're not doing that anytime soon. Your processing units, that's a question. Indeed. I don't even have those set up. We can't even make those yet. We need advanced circuits first. Processing units. Yeah, we're not at a point to really get a bunch of those. So, I might just do Michael Armor. Just to get us some robots. We have sulfur here so we can get a little patch for beginning whateverness. And that. Alright, so let's compare these real quick because I'm kind of curious on these guys, right? So, uh, we've got 10, 20, 10, and 20, right? Percentage wise, then this is 30, 35. Yeah, it's a lot better. And it has the grid size, so yeah. Better in just about every single way. I'm getting inventory sized. Really? What was the inventory bonus? 10. Do we have one more extra line for inventory? Nifty. Nifty indeed. Uh works. Okay. So sulfuric acid, please. Water. Son of a Monkeys are cool. Ran off that piece. I forgot. I'm gonna get here. This setup is terrible. It is awful. Um, I have an idea. It's stupid, but it's gonna work. Let me split this list a little earlier. And have the iron gum here. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. This is dumb. It's happening anyway. I need a pump. Let me clear that spot. So, and we need a pump. Opt for a pump. And. These two sets of underground, at least two sets of underground. And there. Like that. Like that. And I'm just gonna have a pipe. It's right across. Another set of underground and some pipes. Do. Started. Get this stupid tree. There. Cool. Got sulfuric acid. That'll easily keep up with demands on that. And we'll start piling up on uranium ore. And there's, you know, a lot of uranium ore here. So that'll just do its thing by itself. We need more power reduction to with what we're doing. Ah, I'll hurt myself. So, let's get power going then. Five of those. Steam turbine. Consume steam to create electric energy. Does it loot 60 a second? So let's double that. And it creates a lot more. So maybe rather than steam engines, let's try out this steam turbine. I don't know. Yeah, just a lot of copper, iron, and stuff. Let's check out the steam turbine and see how this works out, shall we? Kind of curious. If it's gonna just like suck up all the steam or what? We're gonna, we're gonna break the line here for a second. Don't put this. Right there.
my stomach, but it's not enough steam. Is that what that is? Is that what the uh, problem here is? I see they max out on steam. That's done. What's the skeleton? How it hurt any? Um, what do I need for the all right, batteries? And it's producing 1.5 megawatts. Right. 1.7 megawatts. And these produce what? Less than a megawatt. So I mean, it's definitely better than one, but not a line. This, oh, I don't have a thing up there. Damn you, my dust! Get my science too, you piece of garbage, garbage. I have walls, right? Yeah, I do. And we're getting kind of close to that time again. Uh, so much to do. No turrets. Yeah, there's no turrets in this, this wall piece here. Where no jumps. For you, buddy. Go borrow some of your ammo. You have a lot of ammo. There we go. Alright, so that I should take care of that for now. Really need those laser turrets going. I'm experimenting a little bit with the steam engine, steam turbine here. Obviously, for now, that's not gonna work. But if I were to say take two of the lines, two of two of these lines, right? Okay, do calculate six slots. Why not? I take two of these lines, right? Would that be enough? No, how does this work? I'm really curious about these things, you know? I want to know how these things work. And, like, does it, in order to get enough steam, do I, do I need to have... <sighs> I'm just not sure. It seems like it's maxed out, you see that? Or is it the temperature? The boilers don't get it hot enough. Is that what it is? Yeah, max temperatures. Yeah, that's what it is. Temperature only 165. That's why you can't just place down the turbines and attach them because you need the higher temperature for the steam. Okay, that's why you need to have fuel rods and everything. I got you. I'm picking up what you're putting down. These all seem to be maxed out across all these are low. Ooh. Oh, did I create a loop from messing with the power? I probably did. So let me take my wood. Just eat the wood, guys. It's fine. I got plenty of plenty of lumber for you to devour. Yeah, this is like it needs more attached here as well. Um, we are satisfied at the moment. At the moment. So turbines are definitely something you can't necessarily reliably use until later on. These are all still going. Yeah, a lot of them are not going. Expect the resource. Away. 
done, done. That one's not done. Not taken care of, good. I know, I know, I know, you guys don't like that. A lot of people don't like this whole setup of mine here. But it's working, it's doing its job. I don't see any reason to stop doing it. At least not for now. Here we go. I already did add the electrics here as well, so. Not like I'm going all steam, all the uh, burner power or anything. It's just, like I stated prior, it's, it really is a case, I'm trying to think while doing this. It's just the case that burners use the fuel a little more efficient, efficiently. Of course, I'm probably not going to worry about coal because coal it creates you get so much coal in this game, and then there's going to be a point where we're not going to be using it nearly as much as we have been in the past. And so it's like, well, what's the point? And there's that. That is that is definitely a thing. I don't deny that fact. But we'll continue using those for now. There's plenty of coal coming up. It's not like fully filled, but we got coal. More than we're using right now. How's our power? Still pretty... It's teetering. It is teetering, which is not what we want. Still water, still are doing fine. Yeah, water's still maxed out. This one pump is taking care of all of this. I'll point that out to you guys. Little bonkers. What do I see it? Let's... It's there. I think we need some inserters as well. I'm a lot of uh, iron, I believe. Play of iron ore. Do I have an extra blueprint book? Destroy that, please. Thank you. And we are backed up in iron. No way. That was a crazy notion. We actually have a complete backup of iron. Uh, character logistics. Production. We don't, have, we don't have production. We can't do that. But we can increase mining production. Let's do that. Let's increase mining production. Why not? Go crazy. Let's go a little nuts, shall we? Now, I'm curious, accumulator, nuclear reactor... Uh, batteries! Right! <laughs> completely forgot about the batteries! Still, and inserts. One of the great batteries. That was the whole reason we were doing what we are doing. So sidetracked in this game, it's ridiculous. I get sidetracked in games like Minecraft, too. And whatnot, but... This is, this is, this one takes the cake when it comes to being sidetracked. But we're going to do batteries in the next episode. So for now, this is a cry and shame part of the long drive by team. I'm bringing you Factorio. Hope you are enjoying the series. All the craziness that the series entails. I'm going to go fill up on material to make sure I have everything I need. Before, uh, going I need, I have extra, I do. I have a ton of extra for these guys. Pipes, that's what I need too. I need pipes. Come here. There. Awesome. So for now, Cry Chain, signing out. So long everyone. Hope you're enjoying the series. Like, subscribe, and share. Share with your friends. If they like Factorio, or don't know what Factorio is, and you want to show them something fun and interesting, you know where to go. Au revoir, everyone. Au revoir. Thanks for watching. If you liked that video, hit the like button below. If you'd like to see more videos like that one, hit the subscribe button. If you'd like to get notifications, make sure to hit that bell. You can also check out our website for more information on different games. If you would like to support us, 
check out our Patreon page for more information on how to do so.